Hello, Leslie here with my new Erin Condren for 2024 unboxing. Um, so I went ahead and opened the lid because obviously the lid has my address on it. So I opened it up and there's not tissue paper wrapped around this. Usually there is. <laughs> so that's the first thing I noticed. Um, everything else seems fine so far. So we'll look at it um, together and unbox this. I ordered the day of um, launch for EC Insiders. It's like the day before. If you're not an in e EC Insider, then it's the next day. I don't know. Um, so, <laughs> so I did order. So here's your little card that you always get in the mail. Um, and it says inspire, celebrate the moments that inspire both big and small. And then there's a 20% off code. And then it says Aaron Condor in the difference, thick paper, proven layouts, highly customizable, made in the USA. And then it talks about Erin Condren Life Planner, um, the best of a calendar, checklist, and journal in one. And then it has some quotes from the Associate Director of Content, EDI Council Co-Chair. That's a big title. Marketing Manager and Affiliate and Wholesale. And then another quote. I don't know. The Life Planner is a lifestyle our team lives and thrives by. And then here's the stuff on the back. Oh, first look at back to school stuff. So this used to be more of like a magazine. It would look like a newspaper. Um, and then last year, I don't think I got one, but then some people did. So it was kind of like, don't know if you got one or not, that kind of thing. So they are going to be doing some back to school stuff. I think they already launched their teacher planner. I think so. I haven't bought an Erin Condor and teach. I bought it one time. I did. Okay, so this is the freebie, one of the freebies for ordering on launch day. Um, it's some post-it notes. Ooh, it looks like it is post-it note brand. I see that little logo, which is good because I bought Erin Condren sticky notes before and they weren't too sticky. So, um, so it's a little sticky sticker pouch and it's got little asterisks all over it and then they're purple. Are they all purple? Yeah. And then it has a little corner in it. Um, it has a adhesive so you can stick it to something, but it says contains post-it notes, meaning like the actual post-it brand. For proper dispensing, pull notes straight up. <laughs> There's a how-to. Um, I'm always using sticky notes. I don't think it'll take me long to get through this, but it looks like there's quite a bit in there. I don't know if you guys can see. I was trying to block it. There you go. Mm, there's a chunk in there. It's more than five, you know? It doesn't say how many. Yeah, it really doesn't, so I don't know. But I will definitely put that in my teacher planner probably. I don't know. All right, next freebie is this, which mine apparently sliced out of its packaging. I have like static on my hands or something. So the, it tore out of the cello bag. So they've done um, planner charms before. So I guess they're bringing that back. This one, it's gold. It's a little gold hook um, clasp. And it says, you are looking, what you are looking for is within you. So that's what it says on there. I like the pastel lettering. That's pretty cute. I'll use it. I'll definitely use it. But I'm going to show you, see if I can get this off of here. Can you get it off? No, it's really hooked on there. I'll have to play with that later. <laughs> trying to get it off. <laughs> okay. Um, you always get a ruler. You get a ruler every year. They have changed this part before, um, but you get a ruler with every planner that you order. So here is my new planner. I was going to pull up exactly what I ordered, but I seem to have set my phone down somewhere. <laughs> So I ordered the new kinds of coil. So it goes from pink to purple to like teal. And then I did order this really pretty colorful cover. So I'm going to just put this to the side real quick. All right. So I did get my name on there because they finally changed it to allow more than the certain number of letters. So I did get run with crafts as I was put on there. I think it's my first one to ever have that on there. And then the cover that I picked does have some rose gold foiling on it as well. And then you open it up. They always have that barcode. This part has changed. It didn't always look like that with the checklist. It didn't. Usually it's one big list. All right, and then you get another little packet of freebies. So let's put this open. So you get these little, I think they're called gratitude cards. So this one's foiled and it says the future is bright. And this one says, you are wonderful just as you are in rose gold. And then this one's in gold, and it says, you are enough today, tomorrow, every day. I like the watercolorness to it. The back is just like a tan color. 
and it says the Erin Condren logo. Okay, and then this one says, hello friend. And then I'm guessing these are, yeah, these are my discount codes. So yeah, so let me know if you want one. <laughs> All right, and then it says life planner, plan a life you love. Talks about the difference, um, the gifts they give to you, accessorize and style. Welcome to the EC family. Yeah, so it has this little card inside. And then you always have that piece of vellum that's in the front. This has some asterisks on it, like in the corners. All right, let's see how it looks. I hope I didn't mess up. <laughs> so it says life planner, vertical layout. Yes, that's correct. They've sent me a horizontal by accident before. So <laughs> this is my life. And then I can put my name. And then, yes, I went with the floral inside. Did I trick you guys? I didn't go with the super colorful, but I did go with that cover because I liked it better. Um, so it says, a beautiful day begins with a positive mindset. And then you have your... So I really liked this font. That's part of why I picked this one. The font is different um, from, from the other styles, from the very neutral one to this one. The font is different. So that's one of the reasons I picked it. Um, and then it says, have enough courage to start and enough heart to finish. And then it says, today choose joy. You have a notes page over here. And this is January. So I loved this. And I figured if I was going to get kits, um, it would mostly cover that if I wanted to. But sometimes I don't use kits on my monthly. So then my monthly still looks pretty. And I just love that font. I do. I do love that font. Okay. So let's go see. Ooh, and I liked this too. Because sometimes you can buy stickers to, like, decorate this, but with the florals, and it's a little bit done for you. So I like that. Okay. And then, right. So this is the we <laughs> the weekly view. Um, I do know that the top are colored. Um, I figured that wouldn't be a problem. I can use white out or um, to do headers or glitter headers like I already do. So I didn't think that would be a problem for me. Um... But obviously, if you really don't want anything colored on your spread, then the neutral one doesn't have any of that. Okay? So that's the color for all of the days. It stays the same. But see, I like the font. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's the other thing. So this is up here. And I believe in this year's planner. Yeah. This year's planner, 2023, is down here. See, and then I went with the super neutral, and it doesn't have any colored headers in my 2023 okay so there's your difference there all right February says what you're looking for is within you hope you guys can see that that looks cool and then here's our monthly spread so I think the flowers are a little bit different it's not like you're getting this yeah because there's like a purple daisy and then there's a different kind of flower here so you get different flowers for each month which I think is kind of cool and then I'm wondering if this looks different or if the notes page is always the same. Let's check it out. Where is it? Mm. Yeah, it's different too because there's more of the purple and that's the other flower. So it changes. I like that. Now the color at the top of here, so it stays the same um, through January and then it'll change to a new color for February. So if you're using it for that... So far, all my pages seem to not be wrong. You really, when you buy a new planner, uh, make sure any planner, you flip through and you check for any flaws. Um, I've had flaws in Happy Planner and I've had flaws in Erin Condren. I'm not, like, trying to, like, say anything about either brand. It's printing. It's binding. It can happen. <laughs> um, so then, and I've had ones before where, like, this is slightly bent, but I've had ones where it was, like, completely crushed. Um, it says, life should not only be lived it should be celebrated for march i like that because that's when our wedding anniversary is and we have different flowers up here for that month make sure you guys can see those that's pretty 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 and then that's what it looks like in the like at a glance or currently page whatever you want to call that all right and then the weekly spread for march goes to a tan see that's pretty neutral but I do know that if I use a transparent washi, you're going to be able to see through it. Like, there is that. It's true. It's very true. <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and skip to April. April says, find 
what does that say? Find the good in every day. And then it has a bunch of wildflowers. And then you have your wildflowers up here. So this one's more white and cream. So it's still like pretty neutral. That's why I picked it. See, and then it's like a gray color up here. But I also like the different um, colors in the tabs. In the neutral one, I think they're all gray. Like I'm pretty sure they are. I'm pretty sure all of these are like gray tones. So that was one of the reasons. All right, May, always have the courage to start. Ooh, look at those watercolor flowers. That's so pretty. Love that. All right, and then it's up here. You guys can see that. It's adorable. Okay, and then we have this color is like a periwinkle. And then this one, you are right where you need to be. That's what that one says. So I'm thinking that, um, I don't think there's anything going to be wrong with this planner, which would be great. The customer service that I've had to deal with has always been really good. So if you do have a flaw, you just reach out to them. Usually they have you like take pictures or something. And it's usually not like that big of a deal or anything like that. Okay. So you're right where you need to be. And then we have the flowers up here. And then for July, how beautiful change can be. See, and I like the quotes. And then there's some flowers up here. And then for August, trust your intuition. And then there's the monthly. And then we have August, the currently page. I'm sticking with it. All right, September. I can do anything, but I don't have to do everything. Ooh, that's a good one for me. <laughs> that is a good one for me. <laughs> now, I'm not sure. Okay, so I'm already like, okay, <laughs> this is really pretty, but I'm wondering if it doesn't really go with the like florally spread that I picked. I feel like some it did, like when I had the purple flower here, I feel like it did fine, but I don't know that it really goes with that one. But maybe I'm getting in my head. I don't know. I wanted to try the new coil. Um, I've gotten a rose gold coil before and it flaked really bad. So I've never gotten any other coil but silver since then because I was like, eh, it's a coating. It comes off. <laughs> so I was brave and I was like, I'm going to try the new color. And that is an upcharge. I'm not going to lie to you guys. <laughs> Definitely is. <laughs> all right, October. It says focus on the good. That's all around you. I like that one. All right, and then we have the flowers up here, November. See that, I feel like it's not, it's not too distracting too. Like it blends well. Align action with intention. Ooh. I feel like I want to write these on my cork board or something. Not cork board. I do have a cork board, but I'm at my whiteboard. <laughs> like in my kitchen. Okay, you are wonderful just the way you are. Cute. I like those light petals. Yeah, I'm really liking this because I'm like, even if I had like a sticker that goes across here, you would only see like a little bit peeking out the top. If I do want to be like, hey, it's December. I really don't want to see flowers. Um, then I could understand that, but I think it's all good. There's the at a glance page. And it's anything from like pages being bound upside down to like it missing a page. Like you got to check your stuff. <laughs> Okay, so then it goes into, it does start, it goes all the way through here. So this is usually the week that I start in my new planner because I like to start the new year in my new planner. You can pick a July start if you're like brand new to Erin Condren um, and you're wanting to start your planner this summer um, or like you're a college student or something and you want like more of a school year planner, um, they have those as well. All right, and then there's notes pages back here. Notes pages. Lots and lots of notes pages. Um, minor lines. I think you might be able to pick dot grid. Anyway, I'll list my description of my planner um, in the, I'll list the description of my planner in the description box. Yeah, I said that. All right, and then it says heritage and awareness observances. And then it has a whole list of them. I'm not going to read them all out loud. That's a long list. <laughs> Let's keep in touch if you want to keep addresses and names and phone numbers and emails in here. 
And then this is a little, allows you to like plan out things if you know about stuff like the next year. Um, then you can go ahead and put that stuff in there. So that's kind of nice. And then you have your back page. And then there's always some free stickers back here. And uh, I don't know about you guys, but I'm guilty of like almost never using these. <laughs> I honestly forget they're there. <laughs> so I will try to do a spread with these or something. But so we have flags, we have teardrops, we have little circles with flowers in them. I like that. We have to-dos, we have habit trackers, we have flower circles, we have stickers that say this week and today and rescheduled and canceled. They're all gold foiled. And then these are all silver foiled. And this is your birthday sheet. It's got cupcakes and birthday cakes and like a little box. That almost does look like a present. And then it says happy birthday, celebrate. I've used these to make birthday cards, honestly. And then these cakes have flowers on them. Ah, oh, that's so cute. All right, and then here's all of the colors of the tabs. <laughs> um, and then rose gold stripe on the side. These are good um, for appointments and things like that. And then the planner always comes with a little sturdy pocket back here. Um, sometimes they've been more colorful than others. Um, my one for this year um, had the like texture to it. So this one's like the solid purple. But I wonder if this pocket looks different um, in the different planner types. So because I picked the floral insides, mine is this purple color, which I think goes well with the coil. And then you always get this um, little calendar. So it says plan for tomorrow, celebrate today. Um, and then usually what I tell everyone <laughs> is that like, okay, I've yet to actually do this. But I usually tell you guys that you could write down what you're grateful for each day. Um, you could write down birthdays. It's just kind of like, it doesn't change. It's dates that don't change because it doesn't have like the days of the week or anything. But if you're wanting a pocket planner or you need to write down an appointment and you want to keep it in here, then you need to start over. But other than that, it's kind of a calendar you can have all the time. And then it says holidays and dates in the back. And then there's important passwords, important contacts. Yeah. I think this was the one that I found a flaw in last year. It says name, phone, and email. And then it said website, username, and password. And I think there's something that was wrong. It was like password twice or something. But... And then there's your holidays and dates, and it's kind of like a gray color, and it's gold foiling. And then this is what they usually look like on the inside. I don't know if I stickered mine up from this year. Sometimes I sticker it. Yeah, I added a little bit. So that's usually what it looks like. It has, like, the little flag and then, like, something that you could possibly write on with, like, those dry markers. They sell them. They sell the markers you can write on here, and then you have to, like, get it wet to clean it off. All right, and then the back, this feels thicker to me. Like, it feels better. I just loved the colors in the swirl, and I feel like this goes really well with my coil. But, yeah, I think some of my, like, divider pages um, are, <laughs> are not the best at it. But look at the color of the tabs. I really like them. I think they're cool. So I like my planner. I'm glad that I got to have my whole name on there this time um, for the shop because I use my Erin Condren for the shop. But then I was just talking about how, like, next year I might switch this to be in my memory planner and then my happy planner be my business planner because I want to be able to pick kits that go with my life so I don't know <laughs> it's still up in the air right I mean it's only May <laughs> so so I have some time I have some time so I would love to know if you ordered on launch day or if you're planning to order um, are you going the super colorful route are you doing the wildflowers what size horizontal, vertical, like there's so many choices and ways to customize your planner. I'm wondering if anybody's ever actually ordered the same planner. Then there was the year that everybody got each other's planners. And like there was a group where we could almost figure out who got whose. It was funny. That was a funny year. Okay, so there you go. That is my planner for 2024, which means you're not going to see this again until that last week of December because I start the new planner then. So there you go. If you have any questions, feel free to ask me in the comments below. Um, I think this is my, hmm, how many Erin Condrens have I owned? <laughs> so my first year of planning, I had a Heidi Swap. Second year, I think it was Plum Paper. So I think this might be my sixth one. This might be my sixth one. And yes, the price has gone up. I think my first one ever 
was 45 or $50, something like that. Um, and the price has gone up, but so you try to find those 20% off coupons. Like I said, message me if you need it, um, or leave a comment and I'll message it to you because it's a one-time use code. So that's why. All right. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, I will try to get this up as soon as possible. All right. Thank you guys. Bye.